Hi, in this video, we're gonna see the solution of practice problem 11.5 from textbook Fundamental of Electric Circuit by Alexander and Sadiku, 6th edition. So, the problem is asking to find the load impedance that L that out from the maximum average power and calculate that maximum average power. So, the solution is step 1. We're gonna use the dependent equivalent method to find the dependent and the dependent. So, first of all, we're gonna remove the current source and it acts like an open circuit. So this is a circuit without a current source. So we got the value of the dependent is 5 parallel with minus j4 plus j10 plus j8. We parallel this and we get the value is j30 plus 40 divided by 13 plus j6. Because it is in a complex form, we're going to change it into a polar form. And we got the value is 50 at 36.87 degree phase angle divided by 14 at 38 at 24.70 degree phase angle. So the final value of the definite is 3.49 at 12. 17 degree phase angle and it is same value with 3.415 plus J0.7357 it is in the complex form and it is in the polar form because the equation is to find the log impedance ZL and we know that L is the conjugate of Z7 in so the value of that L is 3.415 minus J 0.7357. And this is the final value of that L. And now we will calculate V seven N, which will later be used to calculate the maximum average power. So the value of V seven N is the same value with the voltage flowing at the 5 resistor. So the voltage is 5 multiplied with IM. And to find IM, we can use the current divider to find IM. And we got 12 multiplied with minus J4 plus 8 divided by J10 plus 5 plus 8 minus J4. And we see we got the value of the dependent is 60 multiplied with minus j4 plus 8 divided, divided by j6 plus 13. Because it is in the complex form, we're going to change it into a polar form. And we got the value is the dependent multiply is equal to 60 multiplied with 80 square root at minus 26.565 degree phase angle divided by 14.31 at 24.70 degree phase angle. So the final value of V Thevenin is, is 37.5 at minus 51.225 degree phase angle and and now we we can find the maximum average power using v so maximum average power is v thevenin square divided by a multiplied with r thevenin which r thevenin is is this is L dependent is 3.415 so the PF PF is maximum average power I mean is 51.47 watt so this is the solution of the practice problem 11.5 
I hope you understand it and enjoy it. And if you guys still confused about this question, about this problem, you can ask me in the comment column below. Thank you.